baby poults, the little turkey poults from the their little pen and they're now in here ready to be transported. Gonna take them out to the shelter for a couple hours, see how they like the shelter, bring them back in tonight before it gets dark and uh, let them start having some nice weather days. some other things. I'm going to let you run around in here and get to know your surroundings a bit. I think you're liking the space. Whoa, slow down. You got to watch where you're going, little ones. They seem to like it in here. We'll see how this goes for them. Uh, wish I'd have gotten them out when the sun was up a bit more. It's a little cooler than I'd like it to be, but it's still fairly nice here, so I think they'll be fine. Uh, this morning would have been awful. So this afternoon has been great, but uh, a couple of hours of this, 
they'll be ready to go back home and maybe tomorrow it'll be nice enough I can have them out here most of the day. I've been threatening for weeks now, not quite months, but weeks at least, that I'm going to get another, uh, what would it be called, not a train, a car on our chicken train out there put together. I've actually got enough wood to make uh, a second additional one. Uh, I have one that's pretty much made. I need to brace it, put wire on it, then make another one and put wire on it. We'll have two more trains to go out there for those guys. Looking forward to that. I say hindsight's always 2020. And in the case of these frames that I made for the chicken train, um, I had what seemed like good ideas at the time. I was just kind of doing it off the top of my head. But we're also working with reclaimed wood, uh, some of it pretty scrappy. So limitations, uh, we're making it on the cheap. Uh, the design went together easy, not as sturdy as it should be. And so I've had to do a little bit of reinforcing. So if you look at some of these corners here, you can see I've, I've added some braces in here, which will make this a little sturdier. The other one I'm gonna use, it's not gonna be quite as scrappy as this. So in the future, I'm gonna be able to have sturdier in fact, I have a totally different design that I think is a great design to use. It's going to do a good job. So on, on the next ones that I build, that's what I'm going to be shooting for. for but for this set, uh, this is what I got. This is what I'm going to do. They were away from their food container for about two hours. Um, guess that's a lot when you're a little guy. They had a lot of stuff to eat there. They need to learn that uh, that's what they're going to be foraging on in the future. So it's good exposure to them. Uh, going to keep doing it every day to get them trained that this is what they do. They go out and they forage, but they are vanished now. They had their first adventure. So what do you think? Do you think our grass needs mowed? I've got to get a rebuild kit for my carburetor on my uh, lawnmower. Can't keep it running. We need to get a riding lawnmower. We finally have some money set aside to do it, so we need to find one to use so we don't have enough money for a new one. So, big job. Got to find the tools to do it. It's crazy. Had a little bit of supper. I figured I'd go for a little bit of a walk this evening, and it's a great time for a walk. I noticed um, the other day, as I was driving into town, that the river level is way down. So, it means they've stopped releasing as much water out of the reservoir, letting it fill up. So. What that amounts to is that uh, water levels here are going to be a little more in line with being able to get down to it. It's not as high up. And I'm excited about that. I'm going to get my fishing license for this year and start doing some fishing. I understand that steelhead are running. At least some people think they are. So I'm excited to get out there and see if I can learn a little bit more about steelhead fishing. So this is this is my place that I get to kind of do some fishing and just enjoy. Can't hear the highway from here, just hear the river running. Uh, I'm excited to get out here and try my luck, see what I can come up with. I'm going to try a few things different than I did last year and see what I can do. Um, pretty amazing place, in my opinion. So I'm excited to see what I can do with it. Let me show you. Thank you. 
Thank you. See you.